everyone, my name is Hart J. Hakis. I'm with uh, Hakis Art and Custom Framing, and we are at it again. We've got another jersey. This time it's a baseball jersey, the, the Mets and uh, Strawberry. It's a signed jersey, number 18. And it's just a, it's just a beauty. Um, we like it a lot, and uh, the customer trusted us to pick the colors for the mats and so forth, and the design and uh, he just gave us a couple pointers here and there, but this is what we're gonna do. So we're gonna mount this on uh, this nice lighter orange mat, which is, uh, you know, goes well with the orange that you'll see throughout the jersey. And we always try to mount it on a color that is, you know, less prominent on the jersey so that it really stands out. So as opposed to white in this case, we decided for the orange, so that's gonna be really nice. And then the mats, uh, what the customer told us to do is that he likes the silhouette to follow the contour of the jersey. And so we did a lot of work to, uh, to trace the jersey in Adobe Illustrator and then converted that over to the software that we use for the mat cutter. And he also sent us a couple of um, patches of the Mets logo and then a photo as well. And so let me show you what we're going to be doing. We're, we're actually... Uh, ahead of the curve here we've been cutting and designing the uh, mats and here's what we have okay so for the the mats the two mats we're gonna go with the um, with the nice strong blue on top and then a, a nice white um, underneath and as you can see it follows the contour of the jersey especially right here along the sleeves and then along the collar um, and then on the other side as well. We haven't mounted the jersey just yet so that's why it moves a little. And then what we're going to do is we're going to use these patches that the customer sent us. And so one is going to go there and we only cut the top mat as you can see so that it shows a little bit of the white mat uh, coming through. And then the other one is going to be over on that side and I can't reach so I'm just going to leave it right there. That looks really nice. On the bottom, what we did is we cut a special opening here and we wanted to continue sort of the, the rounded corners theme that we started up there at the top. And so we have a uh, sort of a certified photo of um, the player here, Strawberry. And so the photo, the opening is gonna go right here. Uh, but I, I felt that it needed a little bit more blue somehow and so what I did is I'm going to put a bottom layer where the jersey is going to be mounted and it's going to look just a little bit offset like so. And again what we're going to do is we're going to mount that properly there and you see the blue right here and then a little bit of white, a little bit more blue and then white and it's just going to look real nice. The other thing that we did here is we actually were actually following the contour of the jersey and that's how we cut these mats here. So there was a lot of design in, um, in Adobe Illustrator to be able to accomplish this, but we're pretty happy with the way the mats turned out. And now it's just a matter of putting it all together. We're going to mount the jersey, which we hand sew it onto the backing board, which is the orange, and uh, securely mount the photo, mount the, uh, the patches up there at the top right and left. And then we're going to raise it up a little, the mats, so that we can give it a little bit of depth so the glass doesn't touch the jersey in any way. Put the glass, put the frame, and then we should be able to... Um, we're going to ship it out. Uh, the customer is out of town. He's not a local uh, customer, so we're going to ship it to him. And uh, we're beginning to do more of that. People like our work online, whether it's on YouTube or Facebook or our website. And they're starting to send us jerseys which we appreciate so we can frame them and send them back. So uh, this is one of my favorites that we've done. And I know I say that all the time, but, but it is. All right, so we're going to show you um, another video in a couple of hours once we have everything mounted so you guys can see the finished product. Hey everyone, so it's been a few hours uh, since the last video and uh, we're pretty much done. 
wanted to show you the final uh, Mets uh, jersey. It's uh, from Strawberry. You can see the photo there of the player. And I want to show you a quick tour, uh, sort of a close-up look. Uh, but I want to, I want to show you the sort of the silhouette that we created for the mats. You can see that it's nicely highlighted by that. Um, it's about a quarter of an inch of white, which is the underneath mat, and it looks terrific. We like it a lot. Um, I'm going to get a little close, and up here at the top, you can see two logos for the mats uh, up there, top right, top left, and. Um, that's about as close as we could add them to the jersey without looking out of balance. You could see the silhouette a little closer, what we did around the collar and then the uh, sleeves left and right. And then at the bottom, you could see the photo, the photo of the player here. It's really, really nice. It's a nice um, professional print, obviously. And we did as many layers as we could on the matting the design so you could see the back blue and then white and then a little bit more blue and some more white just looks really really nice um, we always have to build these um, spacers these uh, they they allow for support for the glass and everything and you can see right there that we use white to cover them for the photo and then I'm um, not sure if you could see the inside but we use spacers obviously to keep the the mats very sturdy, very rigid, and to, you know, enough uh, strain to hold a photo. And then at the bottom, we did that special opening there where we follow the silhouette of the jersey at the bottom. Really cool. We stretch it as much as we could without distorting the shape. And um, I like it a lot. I, I like the, the strength of the colors, right? Orange um, as a backing and then a, a really bright, very rich blue with a white uh, strip. You can see there a quarter of an inch and um, it's ready. Um, again, I'm just gonna close the back. We're gonna put the, uh, the hanging hardware on the back and this is actually gonna be shipped out as opposed to someone uh, coming by to pick it up. Uh, so we're pretty excited with this.